a Dread Fun original production. Please sit back and enjoy. Standing six feet six inches, weighing 375 pounds, from Duluth, Minnesota, world's strongest man, Phil Fister. <laughs> and hey, guy, uh, hi, Dread Fun here with another one of my video uploads. This is, uh, yeah, we're getting up there. We're almost to the end of this uh, journey. This is, uh, as I said, Phil Fister, world's strongest man. Uh, one of the, uh, I think he's the only man, the only American to win the title after uh, Bill Kazmaier. Um, he was uh, a great competitor. I've seen him a number of times. Big guy, big, big, big guy. 6'6", 375. Looked like, you know, the blonde hair. Looked like he came out of a cornfield or something. Um, Mr. Fister competed in the 1998 World's Strongest Man, where he came in fourth. In 2000, he came in fifth. 2001, again, came in fourth. And then there was a bit of a break there. Uh, he, he competed again in 2003, where he didn't qualify. Uh, took another break. And then 2006 was the big year that he ended up winning it in China. Uh, then competed three more times in 2007, where he came in fourth. 2008 was another fourth, and finally 2009 he came in seventh. So not a lot of podium finishes there, meaning one, two, or three, but definitely a top five strongman and uh, a very entertaining strongman. Uh, uh, I really, like I said, enjoyed uh, joy. I I love doing this drawing. You'll see as it's coming together right now. It is an action shot. Uh, if you watch the strongman or world's strongest man, you'll know exactly what point this this picture was taken it was at the moment when when Fister won the world's strongest man by defeating Marius Pudzianowski in the Atlas Stones um, he sort of you know just slowly got that last stone on just before Pudzianowski and then he turned and you know he still got chalk on him from lifting those big Atlas Stones and he he just goes like this ah, and he's screaming and you just man it was awesome that was his big year that was the year he won it the only year but you know Still a pretty incredible accomplishment. One thing that I also found interesting is uh, this guy is also a fight, uh, firefighter in Charleston, West Virginia, and that's uh, that's where he resides in now and uh, is a big member of his community and whatnot. So, uh, yeah, that was uh, Phil Fister, World's Strongest Man. Um, again, just to tell you a little bit about the pencil drawing. I lay it all out uh, in light first. Uh, with this particular drawing, yeah, I did do quite a bit of measurements. I, I knew exactly how tall I was going to make the image on the page, kind of where the uh, hands were going to go and the head. And I did have a bit of trouble with the face. Um, I did a couple trial drawings uh, trying to get that image from the side because, you know, when a person is screaming, like in my Magnus Samuelson, uh, World's Strongest Man video, he's lifting an Atlas stone, and it was a great action shot, but you can't really tell that it's, Magnus's face because he's all blown out and puffed out and it's straining and with this one I was worried that would happen too because in the image uh, Fister is very, he's, like I said he's pumped, he just became the world's strongest man, he just beat it, the legend Marius Pudzianowski so it was a big deal and uh, I really wanted to get it right and uh, as you see I think I did it uh, it was really really a lot of fun to do uh, went back and made sure to do a lot of the smudge work to bring out just, you know, a really, uh, I feel, a, a classic image that depicts a moment in time that was really important to a lot of people, especially the gentleman that I'm drawing, Mr. Phil Fister. Anyways, it was a blast doing this. Uh, I've only got a couple more of these, uh, well, until uh, the 2013 champions declared. Anyways, uh, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel. Dread Fun out. <laughs> this has been a DreadFun.com production. Thanks for watching.